Hi, I'm Katie Couric and welcome to Eye to Eye. Most climate experts believe the next decade is going to be a hot one. They're predicting an increase in the pace of global warming. Daniel Seberg traveled to the Arctic where he joined a group of scientists studying the effects of climate change. Uh, why is the Arctic so important in terms of understanding climate change? Well, the Arctic is just a key player in the whole system. It's where the uh, excess heat that the Earth absorbs in the low latitudes escapes into space. It uh, plays an important role in the radiation balance by all this white around us reflecting sunlight back into space. Uh, the, we're standing on a river of ice that's streaming out of the Arctic. This ice is relatively fresh. When it reaches the North Atlantic, it's going to melt. It'll make the waters there fresher and lighter and affect the whole ocean circulation. The words climate change are tossed around a lot. What, what does climate change mean exactly? Well, well climate, first of all, is, is the average of weather. It's the long-term uh, physical environment that you experience. It's the temperature, it's the, the rainfall, it's the, the winds, the storms all of the things that go through our average year. Um, and climate change is something you can bank on. It's always going to happen. It always has. It always will. Uh, if we had been here, the same spot, 10,000 years ago, uh, we wouldn't be standing on sea ice. We'd probably be on a, a glacier extending down off the um, coast of Canada. If we went back 120,000 years, we might be treading water. If we're looking at our planet now and seeing all of these things happen, maybe it's some warming, uh, icebergs melting, is it too soon to say whether all of that is simply a cyclical pattern that happens? When do you sort of make a decision that all of this that's happening now is an anomaly and it's not what should be happening? Well, we are, we are getting warning signs. Um, the signal of climate change is slowly emerging from a, a, a background of, of natural cycles. The numerical models that are used to predict climate are pretty much in agreement that we're looking at a response to greenhouse gas warming. It's not a stretch long term to say that what's happening in the Arctic could have an impact on everything from say hurricane patterns and strength to drought in the West? It's, uh, that's not a stretch at all. I, I think uh, when, when you're talking about climate, it, it's, a, it's something that takes place on the size of the earth. It's never a local, isolated, uh, independent uh, thing. 